As you can see the results in the left side the original video in the right side is the mascot video which is me and it's also you can make the background as you want as you can see it's working almost fine yeah this is the result and looks hi everyone welcome back in this video i want to show you how to subtract background in a camera or in a video uh, you already seen the results at the beginning i will also show at the end uh, i will also put this code to github so you can check from there so i don't wanna explain the code exactly i just want to talk about the algorithm i used uh, first of all i'm using a reference taking a reference from the camera in grayscale i'm converting it and also i'm uh, converting into hsv channel and i'm taking saturation scale and then i also compare each new frame with the reference frame in saturation and grayscale uh, why i'm using saturation instead of hue or value because uh, cause of experiments I did some experiments and I just get the best results in saturation channel so I'm using this also grayscale I'm using to make the code more light then also in the other step I'm doing if absolute value differences bigger than 25 but with what I mean in here um, I'm I'm comparing as I said in step 3 I'm comparing each new frame with the reference frame. If the differences pixels with the reference frame in gray scale and in the saturation scale, if the differences bigger than 25, which is uh, this threshold available for me, then I'm marking the pixel in the result map. Then also I'm making a road and the light and I'm making this two times because it seems more uh, suitable for my site you can make this one time or you can change according to results you got then also I'm checking after all this I'm checking in the results if there is non-zero pixels in gray channel domain and mark them for result image and after comparing and I get the result if there are some uh, pixels which I got from the previous steps and then I'm marking them in the result in the result image and if there is still remain pixels from the grayscale uh, comparing I'm again comparing them with the saturation domain then I'm marking again six in six step I'm making the comparing the get uh, I'm handling the grayscale differences in the seventh step. I'm handling the saturation saturation domain step which um, The pixels I'm handling the rest from the step six and in at the end. I'm just uh, Taking the pixels which are valuable and then if the, there is still black ones I'm changing them with my background my background actually this is in the video also you seen uh, this background which is the same resolution with my camera if you directly copy my code please uh, careful about the about the resolution you your camera has and please change these values according to your camera pixels my code still has need uh, need many optimizations this is just basement code maybe i will update this code later but for now this seems working fine until now but i will change this absolutely because need some optimizations and requirements here at the beginning uh, like in every sub uh, background subtractions at the beginning your camera should take a reference and you shouldn't be in front of your camera and second requirements is camera should be constant because if your camera moving the background will be changed so your code will not work this is not ai based subtraction as you can this is just morphologic operations doing 
and cause of this uh, there should be of course some requirements like the other applications it's not working based on an AI it's just working on on the morph morphologics operations of OpenCV so this is the end of the video I will show you one more time the results see you in the next videos as you can see the results in the left side the original video in the right side is the mascot video which is me and it's also you can make the background as you want as you can see it's working almost fine yeah this is the result and looks fine also you can make video in the background like in here uh, not only picture but moving background you can do also yeah if you um, if you add a simple code to my code you can also make here video I think the results as you can see seems good is subtracting myself from the video and the result seems pretty fine I think yes